Hello everybody and welcome once again to Galactic Science 2. Um, between the last epi episode and this episode we had an update and so we're now on 0 0.09 and a lot of fixes have happened which is great. So now these recipes that I've been having trouble with are all seem to be working and so we can get on. Now the first thing I'm going to do is fix my cobblestone generation automation because it's not working very well. And I figured out what the problem is, so let's go and have a look at that first. It seems that I had here on this end of this a um oh what's it called? Let me have a look. A rationing pipe. And then the rationing pipe it was preventing the oxygen going in there, which I was a bit strange about. But it's wrong because I've got magnesium here as well, so let's get rid of this magnesium. And we've probably got too much oxygen because we're, some of the magnesium oxide has been decomposed. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to change this design a bit. You'll see this is already completely full of um, cobblestone. So it's been working pretty well. But these have come, I haven't had enough pipes. So actually I'll go and get those, shouldn't I? Let's go and get those first of all and put this magnesium oxide or these magnesium away in the upstairs. Let's do that first. And go and get those rationing pipes from here because they're all oh, 22 of them now have been made so we're now concentrating on ender pearls again because i think i've got enough this time to actually complete this automation i'm half tempted i'll do the i'll do the fix first because the fix is actually quite easy because why well, oops a bit, a bit jump um the problem is this this has got 240 and it's not all going in there. Well, that's not surprising really, because if you're thinking about it, it's rubbish. I did really. That was a really not the best design ever. Get rid of that from there. What we're going to do now is we're going to put a, a filter on this one here, just to take out magnet uh, silicon dioxide. Let's get one of those out of there. Like that. Okay, and we need some filters which I haven't brought with me. Ah, classic. Never mind, let's put... Yeah, I'll go and get the filters. I need the filters. Can't progress without the filters. And this should be in this chest here. I should have two. Yes, I have. Good. So, one filter we're going to just... All we're going to get out of here now is putting this output here is just um, silicon dioxide. So let's take one of these filters. Let's do it like this, really. Right, click it put sil silicon dioxide in there so that and then we're going to put that into this one here so that can only be silicon dioxide and the other filter we're going to put this magnesium oxide like that and we're going to pull out of the front here because all the other faces are actually busy so let's pull out of here put take one of our transfer nodes here put into that oh it's already got it in it's great some magnesium oxide so all we now need to do is to put the cache on the front of this so let's do that. In fact, I'll put it on the ground. It looks nicer, doesn't it? So I want it. I think I want it here. Oops, wrong one. Try again. And then we just put one pipe between the two. Hopefully, we don't need more than one pipe. Like that. So now magnesium. Only magnesium oxide can come into here. In fact, I didn't even. Yes, I do need the filter so it doesn't block up. And only silicon dioxide can come through here. So we've still got some magnesium here. We need to get rid of that now. And I've got a feeling that the oxygen is going to be out of balance because of the magnesium oxide going in there. Because it's exactly right. So let's... What we're going to do to do this... I think we'll remove everything. Let's just... Yeah, let's remove everything. they move around as you do them so what we need oops it keeps moving around of course can I put that there like this so we should get two stacks of oxygen for every stack of silicon yeah I'll let it fill up and hopefully we'll see that in operation that's moving the oxygen there let's do it like this Oh, 
put that in there and that one in there and that should start to fill it up it might be slightly out of balance still so I'm not 100% sure let's just do it like that and you see this is working quite nicely so this will now be full of um, cobblestone so we need, need to bring this cobblestone back up here well, I actually would like this to be sent to be uh, symmetrical so let's make this a bit symmetrical too so this is empty so we can quite happily bash this chest away here and bash this note transfer node away here and then put on what came out of that so oh yes of course some sulfur let's put that like that and then we can join these two together I don't want that connecting maybe I have to go at one like that and then in the middle here we can put the transfer node um, so I want the chest on that I think I have to I have to break it yeah it's not quite in the middle anyway is it so let's just put the transfer let's put the chest down here where is it going to come down through this line I'll get the right line so it actually wants to go on here like this so if I put the chest here like that I can get it probably too near get it on that one there yes that's great so now I can take it remove this one and put into that the transfer node but jump out of the way of course so let's put the transfer node up here so that's now connecting up so we'd all we need to do is now connect everything up in this direction as well and we've got 18 transfer pipes that should be plenty This one actually wants to go onto the chest itself, doesn't it? One more. Let's get in the right place. Yeah, got it. So now this should be filling up with cobblestone. Should be. Let's double check that, making that sure that's actually filling up with cobblestone. Yeah, it's going out and it's coming in at the same time. So it had 64 in there before. So that means that they're coming into these, I guess. Yes, look at that. So they're no longer empty. They're now getting cobblestone in there. So that's the whole loop done. So the last part of this puzzle is to make some... This is an auto compressor. We can take some of this out of here. Now, what I want to do is to take this out at a higher point. So let's just... We really want the extra bits to come out of here. So if I just put this compressor here like this and then it's going to start getting cobblestone in it needs power too of course that's I had forgotten about I need to get some power cables I probably haven't got enough power cables for that at the moment but I want to see some cobblestone coming in here there it is you see and I've taken I've also taken away the, um, the sterling generator because I put it over here just to give this thing a bit of boost while I was waiting between times like that I was just putting it down here wasn't I and I did also take the carbon out of here so that's now feeding these up again so let's go and get some the carbon out of here I've got lots of oxygen and silicon in there let's put the carbon into here like this one not very much okay let's get rid of the, the chemicals we've got and also get the cable if we've got some left so oxygen magnesium and silicon I don't have in there let's put oh, carbon I've got some carbon that's strange silicon let's get rid of that need a power cable don't we so maybe I've got some power cables in my bits and pieces chest in here I've got four might not be enough well hopefully it is let's have a look I didn't count up so if I connect the power cables on here like this and I actually want to go this way 
Ooh. Now one short, what a nuisance. I wonder if I can shorten it in some way. Well, I could put it on here, let's do that. Yeah, I don't, I prefer it not to connect if it's possible. And go up one, huh? Well, that should work. There we go. So this should now be getting power and starting to compress this cobblestone. Now the next trick, to take the transfer node here out of this one, like this, I need another filter and I don't think I've got another filter. And we want to put Ophelia back in again, like this, so it goes round. You know, I, I don't like the way those try to connect up, I don't quite understand why they would want to connect to a pipe anyway. So as you see now we've got double compressed cobblestone, compressed cobblestone, but I don't want it to quite work that way. So let's see if we can make another uh, quick filter. Because what I want is triple compressed cobblestone. And I don't know where I can make another filter. I think I haven't got enough string at the moment. I probably certainly haven't got enough twi uh, uh, sticks. Let's have a look. Oh, I've got enough str oh, that's good. We probably can do it then. We just need one piece of wood. So I've got eight. Let's just put that. Let's just fill this in here. Oh, I've got more than I thought. Great. So what we're going to do here now is to put into this, we need this here. So we need some triple compressed cobblestone. So what I'm going to do is, maybe in here we've already got some double compressed. So we have to wait a little bit longer. Let's take a stack out of here and shove it in there. Maybe we'll get some triple, triple compressed cobblestone. You see it's going around nicely now. And what I also want is another is another um, chest or cash. Let's go and oops, sorry. Let's go and get a another chest or cash. Probably cash will do be best actually. It's a bit like the jabber barrels. Oh, wrong. I haven't got any. I haven't got any there. So look. This will do fine. Make another cash. So what I'm going to do with this, oh, I need another transfer node if I'm going to do that, don't I? Uh, yeah, that's not going to work for the time being. But we should get, so we've got double compressed, double compressed cobblestone now, one more of those will make a triple compressed cobblestone. And what I can do is make an inverting filter so that the triple compressed cobblestone doesn't go through there. Let's do that. So an inverting filter is very straightforward, it's a redstone torch. I, know I need some more wood. I need some for torches. So I've got some already. Um, let's do it like this. Some redstone. A bit short of redstone at the moment, actually. And we just can't, we just craft that with this and like that. And that'll make an inverting filter. So when I get a piece of triple compressed cobblestone like this. We can put that into here. Have we got one yet? Yes, now we've got a triple compressed cobblestone. So we can put this into the filter here. So that means that everything except for triple compressed cobblestone will go out through this filter. So let's put the filter in there. And we can put this back into here now. So eventually this will fill up with triple compressed cobblestone. But before that happens, we'll have made another node. So that's no big deal. So the only problem I've got here now is just making sure I've got enough um, carbon for this to be to keep running let's put that in there like that in fact so that's it so the only thing i've got to do with this is to make sure this has either got a lot of carbon in it or connect that to the power supply over there which is in fact the the intention in the long run i want to connect it to here and bring it all the way across down here but i don't have enough cable or wool for that at the moment i'll need quite a bit of wool so that is working and of course this would probably need to be voided or upgraded but the magnesium 
oxide is useful for certain things and I'm hoping you see this is just working just ticking its way over and so is this and this is actually full of um, silicon dioxide and the trouble with this one is it's not fast enough so what I could do for that we've got all these um, stack upgrades let's go and get a stack upgrade from the right room let's take those three stack upgrades and let's also take some more glowstone because that's always useful too I actually quite like the effect of glowstone oops let's put that back in there that's got glowstone in and we don't actually care whether this is because it's not full of cobblestone so we don't care about that this one is not getting enough items in here so let's have a look in here we haven't got a stack grade upgrade in here let's make a stack grade upgrade so now these are going in by stack by stack so this then should be receiving a stack at a time which it is and those are going out fast enough for these to be processed here and they're not it's, as you can see it's hardly it's keeping up nicely there's some silicon here if you leave it in it doesn't make any difference what we're doing here so it's just carrying on making more double compressed cobblestone going round the loop and we'll end up with some more triple compressed cobblestone in there and then we can process that afterwards so how are we doing for this so this is now almost emptied out of obsidian all so quickly so it had 10,000 in before didn't it and this is also not working very fast And it's not getting any in so let's make sure that this is actually pushing the cobblestone out of this at a stack at a time because it's a bit slow so that should be going out one stack at a time and i hope i might need to put a round robin on this one actually let's have a look yes we'll go and do that next i'll go and get a round robin that's there's a fairly easy look at those mobs below us it's going to get it's actually night time isn't it so we could have sleep first we'll do we'll do the round we'll do the other bit change the oxygen tank while i'm thinking about it what did i want to do <laughs> oh yeah round robin let's have a look for round robin and that's this one i'm not sure i've got enough oh i have good i'll make three now i'm basically almost out of redstone in fact thinking about that let's go over here and make sure how this is doing that's about full so we need to get rid of some of this stuff so it can carry on processing and what i've got here is iron and um uncompressed uncompressed coal and that recipe is now working let's go put the iron over here like that in fact there's no reason I couldn't take all of this out of here but no I won't I'll do it from here first of all so let's go down and put into this one here the a round robin like that so then that will be going into here as you see it's gone in all of it's been going into here i think because it's nearest and none's been coming into here now you can see it's starting to work properly they're all filled up at about the same level too which is fantastic in fact i don't even need these pieces connected anymore so we should remove these because they're connected at that end i might should really put a round robin in there too but like that So that's working pretty hard. Is there anything else I need to remove from in here? Let's put in that. I've just got some magnesium oxide on me. And up we go. I want to do and just make sure that all of those have got these. Um, yes, this one hasn't, you see. So if I put in a piece of glowstone into there. 
you'll see it going through and we can also put a piece of glowstone into here as well you'll see this be going round but it's actually connected to here as well so we need to fix that so what I don't want it doing is I don't want it going to the left so let's that'll stop it going from the left and I don't want this one going to the right I'm not sure I can do the oh yeah it's perfect look at that so as you can see that's going around that loop and this is going up here yeah and you can see how it is actually moving fairly slowly but it's probably moving fast enough for these to work I will put a round robin oops didn't mean to click right click that let's put a round robin into here anyway because it isn't going to do any harm I'll put a piece of close down oh that's not good look at this I've got a that's why it's not going over this side so let's just fix that must have hit it there we go so that seems to be working just fine except for we need to find a solution to providing that with either uh, carbon or a fuel or power from over here those are basically the three options now there's probably a load of mobs look at those mobs underneath me somewhere I think they're underneath let's go out of here there's any mobs around here none oh, look, plenty of other plants I think they don't like it coming over this this near to these things here. So I'm not 100% sure if that's the reason or not. Just doing a bit of gardening while in the night time, a bit dangerous. Oops, you see. I'm going to remove these. let them get on with it and we'll go to a quick sleep see I lost a couple of those when I was harvesting those because I did it uh, in a bad way let's just get rid of this XP and let's decompose the uh, cactus and go to have a quick sleep should now be nearly decomposed take those let me feed that in the water it's just a sort of the, the normal type of thing we have to do every day so I I'm actually not I would normally sort of not do this on camera but this is a sort of a let's play so I want to cover more of this the grind that we have to do in this one Right, good. Let's put these bits and pieces away into here. Because we don't need those at the moment. And we'll have a quick look at what quests we've got. We can actually finish now. So, Moon Trance, we're just waiting for this to fill up. I don't know how far I've got with that. I'll go and check it in a minute as well. Um, stars Align, we can't do elements. Well, the next element we can make is the... Uh, we can't do this one and we can't do the compressor because the compressor is a tier 2 or level 2 item but we probably can do um, the compress the bedrock this one and that will give us some bandwidth upgrades and some machine filters for the routers what else have we got on here sorry ok done that one this one we can't do but maybe we can actually make a pattern because that will give us a loot chest so we need a calculation press let's just have a look what we need for a calculation press let's grab a calculation press so we can use 30 blocks of iron and one ender pearl well, that's actually not too expensive let's take one ender pearl and we haven't got 30 blocks of iron I have to get some more 
and you know how to do that now we come along here take the iron out of here take the oh what have we got in the aluminium so let's get rid of this aluminium and turn off this one yeah so I want the iron into there put the iron back in here make sure everything's it kept in order and then we can take let's remove the liquid Should, uh, not quite let's do one more so now we've got the iron in so we can remove the aluminium blocks which of course we will need let's put those into there so we need nine more blocks of iron that's going to take a little bit of time what have we got in here 30 that we're still actually making these things we could put one in the pearl and one blocks you see these get highlighted but when this is gets 30 it'll actually highlight the, the other recipe as well is that making end pearls? It's doing all right, actually. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's not far off uh, finishing that end pearl. Is it three quarters of the way full or something like that? So have a look. How many blocks of iron have we got now? Three. Oh, it's a bit slow, this process. Let's actually four. Let's go and get um, see what we got for ingots in here. Okay. Make three at seven. Well, we're only too short. That probably made by now. see now we get all of these items in here so we can actually make all sorts of things like we want the calculation press don't we which we can't see let's remove these let's grab a calculation press and we can put those back in again and it'll work this window is just a little bit small and how much do we actually power do we need for that I'm not 100% it doesn't tell you from here Anyway, we'll let it do its business and see what we've got to do next. Let's get rid of that and put the glowstone back in again. Oh, let's clear, let's clear out this um, this chest from here until we actually get some more automation going on into this. So that's already full. Let's get rid of the stone bits. That's full. Let's go and put those into here and get those out of the way. And let's see what ores, or, ores we've got in here so we can get a few ores in here as well yep that's great got nine diamonds that's not too bad let's put the stones Ooh, i think i threw one actually oh right, so it's full And then the broken ores we can put into this chest. Like that. And then go and make sure we've got everything cleared out. That's finished out. We've got space now. It doesn't take too long to clear that thing out. What else have we got in here? In fact, it looks like this is now empty. Which it is, so we take another stack of carbon put the carbon into this chest and it'll start the process again as you can see starting to get moon rock straight away oh I don't need to do it here let's do it in the quick place anyway I know I know it's a bit of a further a bit of a walk but oh, let's walk really, really. yep that's it so now Let's go and have a look at the next quest so we can actually do. So that one is on the way. 
and I don't we could make this one but I'm not going to just yet because the rewards are just XP and I know that the next one after that we can't do sorry let's go back again press the wrong button this one we won't be able to make because that basically means we have to do walls and things which is really tier 2 so that one's on the way and this one's also on the way as it happens we've got enough now for the uh, diamonds I think so that's that one done so improvements let's have a look at improvements now the important improvement here is this enchant enchanting efficiency one book so let's have a look at how we do that I see it. Huh. <laughs> Let's try and chant. Oh, maybe I should get rid of this press. Ah, oh, the recipe's not there. Why not? Let's have a look. Well, I just had a crash, but at least we can see the enchant the enchantment book here now, and the um, we get a reward. So let's have a look. What do we need for this? Because this is actually a bit of a nuisance because you've got to go through all these books to find the one we want. So we need three ender pearls, ten shiny blocks, one book, three blaze rods, and ten rotting flesh. I'm not sure I've got enough rotting flesh actually. What time is it now? Probably missed all the rotting flesh that's been sitting out here. Could probably be despawned by now. Especially after that game crash. If there would be any, there would be out here. No, unfortunately, I don't see any. So it's all despawned, which is a bit of a shame. Actually, that's the first game crash I've had with this mod pack, as it happens. Let's have a look. So how much how much rotting flesh have we got? Oh, 11. That's enough. We need we only need 10, don't we? And the pearls. These ones we need three, I think. And the pearls we got one. That's not enough. What else do we need? I think we need just some glass and some glowstone, don't we? So there's some glowstone, then we need some obsidian. We can go and get some, maybe there's some still left downstairs. Yeah, let's take a stack of obsidian. No, two. How do we need 198? Probably be three stacks in that case. Let's take three stacks. and decompose those. Let's remove these items out of here. Nitrate. And decompose this. I've got to go and quickly check that recipe because I want to set the recipe for glass. Let's do that. That was me testing the signal and that's now working. You see that's still going up but emptying out into here so we, you can see how that's working that's working quite nicely now and that was just one stack and it'll fill up that chest no problem at all so what do we want um glass don't i let's get rid of that we wanted some silicon dioxide four in each corner glass. I'm going to get rid of these items out of here too. I've got a feeling I might have put the silicon dioxide that I wanted in there. But never mind. Let's get rid of these. In fact we can get rid of everything from here can't we? We can get rid of the magnesium 
outside. Fifty six, is that all? Alright, oh, that was only one stack, wasn't it? We should get sixty four. Oh, yeah, we have, so that's fine. We didn't put anything the wrong away. I'm going to have to check that recipe again because I've already forgotten what it was. I just wish I could find the um, this recipe without having to go through everything so long, long-winded. Let's go to the left hand side; it's faster. Fourteen flesh, one book, and ten shiny ingots. I don't need glowstone, and I don't need glass. That was for something else. Never mind. So we need one book. A book is keratin. Have we got any keratin in here? Yes. I just want one of those. That'll give me five pieces of leather in the synthesizer. I'm not sure where it goes. Nope. Top right. Nope. Top left. No. <laughs> so it's in the middle. Yes. I'll double click. Let's get rid of that. That'll give me five books. And we just need some, we just need some um, paper now, don't we? So let's just take some sugar cane. I should have plenty of that. There we are. Let's take a stack of paper. It won't do any harm. One book. So we're just short of ender pearls. What else we're we short of? I don't need that. I don't need that. Ender pearls, rotting flesh book. There's five items, and that's the four. I should write it down, shouldn't I? Let's put these. In. Let's put these items into here anyway. Oh, it's not going to show up very well. So until we get the ender pearls, we've got two. Yeah, one's for something else, isn't it? And hmm, I'm going to have to go through that oral recipe again. Sorry, you have to forgive me for this. Me messing around with this one. Funny, it doesn't show up. Is it? You want to put, oh, there it is. Look. That has been a real oh it's the ten shiny ingots isn't it let's see if we can do shiny ingots I'm not sure if we got ten blocks or not we might have by now actually so shiny is this one so let's get rid of the iron from in here put the shiny in here let's see what it's doing it's actually I think it's actually used up all the iron we've got so that's there we go, so it's making shiny ingots now. Put the, put this back in again and sort that out so it'll get put out. And let's take some stacks of iron just to make sure we've got enough. Probably not enough and let's fill it up. What do we want? Just two more stacks. And that'll slowly to get work its way through and make lots of iron for us. How many? I will have to wait for these ten blocks of shiny to come through. I don't actually look much different from anything else as it happens, but I probably don't want that type of a uh, shiny metal. So let's just come through here and convert this to the one we actually want. One. So we want this one. So let's come along here. Oh, yeah automatic one and put that down there in fact what it might be worthwhile doing is doing analysis as well let's just take craft that into, oh that's actually going to the right type anyway that's thermal foundation and that's thermal foundation but we'll we'll put it into this recipe into this recipe book here anyway so it's consistent so and of course we can simply then recraft that back in again to make another block 
and it's made Tech Reborn. That's weird, isn't it? <laughs> put that through and put that through. Oh, this one didn't go through. Oh, there you go. So we now got three out of the ten that we need. And I'm well over my time today. I'm sorry about that. I do apologise. Alright, two more. But there might not be. I was thinking that maybe that it. Because the crash didn't actually kill Minecraft. Uh, it it somehow disappeared, but it was still running in the background, and it, that means it could actually be carrying on with the recording in the background as well. Right, that's our ten blocks. Let's now turn this off. Let it empty. Convert these because I know that this thing is actually fussy. There we go. So we now got our ten blocks of shiny. But unfortunately we can't see the recipe until I remove some stuff. If I remove this and this. Oh I must be missing oh of course I'm missing ender pearls. So I have no chance in seeing that until later on. So that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. Till then, bye for now.